to fulfill a reaction request. Finally, Yay! it's Yay! ReZero starting life in another world. Third time's the charm. This yeah. is it. We yeah, had this on yeah. the schedule, and then something came up. Something shit hit the fan worthy came up each time. And now we are finally gathered here to give this anime a fair shake. We are not reacting to the whole series. This is a reaction request. Check out our Patreon tiers if you're interested in doing so yourself. Who requested this tier bad boy there, Mark? Yes. Jesse, Jesse Collins. Collins. This is uh, 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 the end of the beginning and the beginning of the end. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> don, don. Don, 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 don. So, not a market substitute, obviously. We bought the first episode on Amazon. It's going to be sub, y'all. It's going to okay. be subs. Okay. Because that's all that's available, I think, on Amazon. If you have oh, VRV okay. Crunchyroll, you can support the official release and watch the dub if you so choose. And uh, support us on Patreon. Again, we can, you can do react requests like this depending on what tier. Early access, uncuts, helps us do our skits, podcast, gaming channel, fun shit, video essays, other stuff that you are going to see in the future. Ooh. And begin. So, Let's see. I, I'm, 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 I'm excited. This? Did a fan make this? No, no, this is like a legit anime. Oh, okay. I'm excited. I want to give it a fair Subaru. shake. Oh, it's in the dub. I'm sorry. I'm okay with that too. I, I, hope, love it. I hope you guys are okay with that. Hey, <laughs> I thought we did sub, but it's dub. Okay. It's already happening. Nah. Nice. Oh, no. ramen. I'll come back to the background. Yeah. What? Did he just move through that? <laughs> yep, he's got the cod eyes. <laughs> what? This is so cool. It's pretty neat. this mean I've been summoned across the universe to <laughs> How did he get that right? Solid, solid conclusion. You know, I would probably think the same thing if I was him. Theme song hype. That was quick. <laughs> it's just an elegant title. Um, well, from the looks of things, I'd say this is some kind of fantasy world with medieval style culture. <laughs> Our realm where demi humans are commonplace, and there's always a war room adventure to go on. <laughs> He's so excited. Yeah, that would be too. Like immediately excited. Hey, boy, those are some weird looking clothes. They're not from around here, are you? Huh? Where's that money from? You can't use that stuff out here in Lagunica. Lagunica. If that's all you got, then you're flat broke. So don't waste my time, freeloader. Get out of here! Oh, God. Oh, man. Come on. What you got against regular humans? No! Jeez, that de escalated quickly. This is a different world summit, right? Where's my main character's head? It's not a video game, bro. It's Dad's bar. Where's my HUD? Where's my display? <laughs> Compulsory event time. Calm down, so he's Subaru. He was in the beginning. Yeah, that's what I was cut up like, and shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bro, you're about to get ass beat. Lumps of EXP. Get experience points, bro. Level up. Why is he? He's saying a game, boy. Because like, I'm wondering, is this a thing? <laughs> <laughs> Dual swords, he said, fuck this. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, and be so kind as to give back what you stole. Something stole from you? Is that flat you just ran by? That way, he said that way, she ran that way. Those three don't appear to be mine, so I need to go after her. Oh my god, oh, yeah. What the? I can't overlook what's going on. Yeah. Yes. Oh, she's Whoa. saying my name. Oh, yeah, she got powers. She's like level 100. Oh my! <laughs> Cats! You Cat crew! Yeah. Cat crew out here! <laughs> oh my god, it has a purse. I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> this will be a fun cosplay to do with your cat. Now listen, I want you to tell me who stole my insignia. Yeah, really sorry about this, but I don't have the slightest clue, to be honest with you. If I were you, I'd hurry after her before she gets too far. <laughs> 
Sometimes some side quests are just straight bullshit. Yup. <laughs> Coming out of it. Cool coins. She's well known in the slums. Do you know where she lives? Maybe someone will tell us if we ask. No one would sell out their own, especially to a couple strangers. So asking would be useless. Yeah, she was like an ultra sketch, bro. Everybody's just standing there looking at yeah, you. Yeah, right. So when the day becomes night, I return to the crystal I was summoned from and prepare for the sun to emerge. Bye, little cake. Bye, little cookie cake. God, yeah, fuck this, dude, during the day. <laughs> Why would you do this? If you can manage to get my insignia back, then I'll apologize. 
Booby trap. Yeah, it's got wards. Magic wards. Oh, shit. Oh. Bro, he's gonna, he's gonna have some magic to heal that. What's wrong? You okay? What? This he's gonna, he's gonna die and he's gonna come back to life. This is a game. Oh, yeah. This is game, maybe. Yeah. This is the game of the episode, remember? Oh, it was. Yeah. This is it, yes. Checkpoint. Checkpoint? Huh? Start from the last checkpoint. <laughs> what do you remember? He remember. Damn it. Puck asked me to take care of her and I totally blew it. I have to find my way back to that shop. Put it on the ground and we'll let you go. Fine, whatever. Everything I've got, right? I'm in a hurry, so I don't even care. Now start acting like a dog. Just get out of fours in hell. Help me! <laughs> you evil. You evil. He never met she. the girl. They never had the cut. Well, so she you. doesn't remember the conversation then. I'm out looking for a small insignia. It belongs to a silver haired girl who helped me out earlier. Don't know why exactly, but it's really important. Man, he Maybe still doesn't know what's going on. Like, how does he not? After all the other pieces he put together immediately. I got somebody bringing in a few goods later on. I'm told it's a pretty fine pile of loot. Mm. Look at what for me it happened to be a girl named Felt. Well, Mr. Know It All. I want to negotiate for the insignia you're bringing. How much are you willing to pay for it? Wow, you don't waste any time at all. Before I give you an answer, you do have the insignia, right? Yeah, of course I do, silly. Now he's gonna get it, and then Satala's gonna think he stole. Yeah, yeah. I don't have any money, but I have a few things worth money. Oh. Oh. I have money. <laughs> <laughs> She's talking. She's like, oh. I, I cut you I off. Like like it. <laughs> oh my god! 
This show's really good. <laughs> Now, that's a good pilot episode. It is. Usually in anime, they just establish the world and they don't quite like uh, kick off the story. No, no, we saw the villain, we saw some fights, we saw like. Starting life in another universe. I don't know who you think you are, but don't ever call me by the name of the Witch of Envy. What were you thinking? Oh, Witch of What? She's the Witch of Envy? Satala? That's why the spirit was like, why would you go with that name when she told him? Maybe she. Interesting. Pug didn't want her to say her actual name because everyone yeah. knows it. That's why the public's looking like. Huh. Okay, okay. Damn, bro. Yeah, oh, man. Probably. I feel like Chris and Mickey and, and he would actually really like this, too. I mean, I mean, I'd be like playing some Call of Duty right now, man. <laughs> Let me get in that game. This, this is like a fantasy, show. like a fantasy like, game. Dude, all I could think of was like Aladdin plus Kingdom King Hearts. Hearts. I knew you were thinking like, Kingdom I Hearts. I know, this is great. Hey, so you missed something. Yeah. So he something. started. He started his life again, and uh, passed out. And so the st- shop owner like woke him up, and then he noticed Satala walking in the street, uh, and was like, "Hey!" Satala. And he was like, "Satala!" And she turns around. And she's like, "Why would you ever call me by the name of the wicked?" The Witch of Envy. Witch of Envy. And because everyone was like looking like that's Satala, so yeah. He, Wait. What? So what? like she 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 must have confided in him in the earlier life by saying her name was Satala because her cat spirit was like, "Why would you say that name?" Maybe because she's like shunned in society or something. I don't know. She's the witch of envy. Apparently. Yeah, which is so Satala. cool. She's Even purple. Even though she seems envy. like she's totally fine. Bro, envy. she's a, she has a cat and purple. And she's a witch. I mean, come. what if they're the same person? Well, that because Satala the, the, and, uh, the, the dark lady also has like purple e- purple and eyes. The same hair also. and the same flower. Yeah. Or maybe. Maybe they're like uh, they must be related. There's some. Yeah, they're probably sisters. A good a good one and a bad one. Maybe her mama, the eagle, or sep, sep mama. Damn, that's pretty cool. This is a really good. She says it's also the the, the the dark lady said she like wants the insignia for her client, but I don't know if that's true. I yeah. think it's for her. Maybe yeah. I mean I don't know if there's someone stronger than her. I don't know what her client wants with that insignia. So like, did they all know what the insignia like who it belonged to? Because when they were like, oh, we return to the owner, I was like, why would she do that? Ah! Like, yes, yeah, if, it's, if it. it's hers and she's the wicked, maybe she's been mislabeled as the witch of envy. Yeah. And she's, like, that insignia is rightfully hers, mm-hmm. but uh. her and uh, Elsa's client's trying to steal it back. Is Elsa's client Disney? Is it Disney Frozen? <laughs> this is a really interesting show. Hey, like, you got in, the money. <laughs> in the beginning, we started out, like, in that mini mart and, like, um, a dimension comes through. And, like, something. our real, like, life or whatever. Yeah, in his real life. And, like, he gets teleported and like i don't he's just so okay so it makes me think like he was so like accepting the fact that he got teleported to another game is this something that happens in the real world mm-hmm. that like you know people if you disappear you're like in a game like because he was so yeah, ex- i don't know what he happened. was accepting <laughs> of it you know he was so accepting and he was like cool was that's like, why i feel like this whole thing's just a game. maybe the yeah. game maybe the game intercepted him from like our dimension because it saw that he was so susceptible to just being okay with this like, he, he, he's used to playing video games in our world and, like, starting and redoing things and doing it better. Because, mm. like, he, he managed to dodge that sword slide, so maybe this world, like, chose him he for a reason. It. He he's still not hit. Yeah, but he, he, he tried. He, he, he got to go a step closer. <laughs> if he pressed circle quicker, then he would have dodged it. But, like, I still don't get it. Like, in the beginning, at the mini mart, that whole part where, like, him and, like, Super and Satella are like, I'll save you. Oh, remember we then saw he was, like, already seeing. Yeah. And it didn't happen, but he was in the real world, not the game yet. And that, he saw that. But, but I don't think, I don't, I don't think he was seeing that. I think it was just for us. He was just reading, like, a magazine yeah. that was unrelated. And we we were just, as an audience, seeing that scene play out. This is for, just for a dramatic effect. Because in the beginning, he was, like, reading the magazine. He was like, oh, they really just, like, drop you right into the action yeah. huh, and suck you in. Yeah. So I, I thought that was a cool I, little yeah, comment because cool. it just starts immediately. And I like how, like, it was kind of, the feel was kind of, like, scary, horror-like. Yeah. You know? Like, at first, it mm-hmm. really hooks you in. And then, like, fantasy adventure. Yeah. I, I feel like we're not watching an anime in this style. Yes. Like, I've never seen an anime like this, which is cool. Definitely. It's like a departure from, like, mm-hmm. So, like, full metal, battling. is it like this or whatever? No, it's, 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 it's kind it's of action-oriented. It's different. It's, like, unique. It is very like, good. You can't really compare it to anything. And like he's like a human. There's like demi humans. He's like, yo, go away. Like you're not allowed. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, the fucking lizard. Oh lizard yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. Apple. The merchant. Apple. That was funny. <laughs> that was hilarious. Cabbages. <laughs> my cabbages. Yeah, that's. We're just not watching an anime like this, so it would be good. cool to check out. It definitely hooked me in. It drew me in. It was a. Uh, 
It's very interesting all the way through. I, I, in my opinion, I love for that. a forty-nine minute pilot episode of an anime, they're usually not disengaging. Like, they usually like introduce the world and not the story. Yeah, but this did both. Did you like it, Pat? It was good. I like Demon Slayer better. I can stand yeah. the gore and the blood for you. <laughs> oh, you, oh, you probably love the part where Elsa stuck the fucking broken I bottle. In. I mean, that was pretty. That's cool. Surprisingly bro. gory for like the tone that we. So I was I was, I was yeah. surprised how gory it got because it wasn't like it didn't seem like that in the beginning. For yeah, it's all power. happy go lucky yeah. and then like blood, you, severed arm. You introduce magic and do magic with the little kid, and next thing you know, someone just died with the, the neck. Puck. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, the little the little kitty spirit. Puck. Did you like the little side quest girl? That's like <laughs> she was cute. Yes, <laughs> was, she was cute. But like I I have a I have a thing with little girl with cute little girls in anime after Full Metal Alchemist. Mm-hmm. I, I get. <laughs> I get like a you know oh, any, any alarm is just, They're just clicking in it's my like head. a it's like a like, bait okay. for don't attach yourself yeah. to the cuteness it's going to betray you. <laughs> wow. I think she's just a little side character. <laughs> you you helped out some side characters in Zelda, right? Are there like any kid? Oh my god! Like, yesterday, get these apples. Yesterday, I had to like collect <laughs> five little bird babies to bird babies to uh, practice for their fucking recital oh, to no. open a, a bird shrine. Baby. For recital? That's Whatever, I had to gather 500 crabs for a side quest. That took me like, a whole stream. 500 crabs? Yes, a whole stream. I had to get, I had to get uh, four pieces of fruit yesterday for a little Namekian boy <laughs> on planet Namek. Namek. For, for Kakarot. Which, which video game would you want to wake up in? Spider-Man, you doing side, side quests in Spider-Man? For one day. I actually low-key no, mm-hmm. man. For one day? Mm-hmm. That campaign in my, man, I mean, my work is nice. I like it. <laughs> I, I, I was playing some of it yesterday. It was kind of cool. Where you gotta like tell the girl where to hide. Yeah. And stuff, she's going through the security camera. You wanna live in that world? That'd be scary, bro. No, no, bro. You military? Be like, that'd be cool. But, but, the thing about that, but here's the thing, though. Like, if you live in a, a world, right? You always, you're immortal. You're never gonna die. So, yeah. it's be the cool to just go around and like mess shit up. Nothing. Because you're not gonna sure. die. You're never gonna die. Nothing. Terrifying. I'd say maybe like. Shit. Grant the bottle game. Yeah, yeah, that'd be cool. Cause, like, That's like real world, anyways. I go to the real world. I go to the real world. I go to the store. I go to the store. Go to the strip club. I don't go shopping. Grandmas, I just rob them. <laughs> just rob them. <laughs> like search other day in the game. He's like, I just want to see if I can kill this dog or baby. Yeah, it was, it was Modern Warfare. I just want to see if you could shoot the baby. And then they well, let you shoot the baby. Just, you could shoot the baby? Yeah. Oh my I, god. I just wanted to see if, it, if the game would where, go that way. Where? What, what part? Did you There's do? a part where like a girl's like, no, nah, she like, takes her baby to the crib, and I was just like, <laughs> I just want to see what must have I shot the dog. The you shot the dog? I shot the dog. You're horrible. You guys are terrible. How about you, Marketa? What's your world? So. She, you tried to park properly playing GTA 5. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on the sidewalk and run in and rob the place. <laughs> She's parallel parking right before she robs the convenience store. <laughs> yeah, that's how you do it. What world would you um, in the video game world? So obviously I would love to be in Breath of the Wild, but a facing Bacoblin could be terrifying. Bacoblin. Um, <laughs> but I think that it would also be fun not fun to be in Minecraft. When you are when you are square. When you I have base to walk like your favorite games. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Run away or from ghosts fucking Pac Man. Oh, yeah. Pac Man. <laughs> Should be terrifying. You're constantly <laughs> moving. It's like, oh, this way, this way. <laughs> also, what if you like bring shit into. Eating. Would you bring shit into the Zelda world from the real world, like a phone? So you'd be like, might this device, and you just match mm-hmm. it to capture a moment tweeties. in time. That is essentially what a camera does, though. You know, it's yeah. a good Kodak ad. Bring I mean, I, said, I feel like that's what people thought back in the day. Didn't they think actually think like they were capturing the moment? Yeah. Like they're like they're freezing yeah. time. I mean, like, you do essentially. I, I feel like Clay do. I feel like the game kind of provides you everything. I was thinking about something to make me fly, but the, you would have the glider. So I'd yeah. your elbow just crack. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I, I like that part where he's like Children. using the, using the phone and shit yeah. to yeah. haggle the prices. What about you, Anna? Kingdom Hearts, or maybe Crash. So you Bandicoot. can go to all the Disney worlds. Yeah. Or Crash yeah. Bandicoot because you can go to different like portals too there too. Mm-hmm. I love Crash. It's so good. Ooh, the the Attack on Titan game. Cool. I don't want to die. Why do you guys want to go to these? I know. I don't want to die. But because you're not going to die, you. I guess, but I mean, I mean, he felt that shit. That was okay. Another part that I liked about this is when he died at the end. He was just Wrong. like. It was like when you're dreaming of death and you're just like, I'm dying, I'm dying, this is it, I'm dead. And then you wake up. And then you wake up. <laughs> oh, fuck. Here's some oppas. <laughs> 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 I 
I like this. I like this. I like how the spirits were described in the show. Like, there's like the lesser spirits, and then like Puck is the spirit that goes in her like to recharge kind of thing. That was cool when the spirits were bubbling up around. That would be a nice picture or painting. So when you die in your sleep, then when you actually die, die in your sleep, you just die in your sleep. Like you're dreaming when you die. When you like, you know, when you're dreaming when you die, you don't wake up. Mm. Are you just dead? Yeah. Because technically you dream. So. I mean, I have not died when I'm saying, saying, like, I'm saying You know like, when you die, when you dream, when, when you dream, when you die, like dreaming that you die in your sleep. Yeah. yeah. You, when you're, when you're dreaming that you die, you wake up because you're not really dying, right? Yeah. yeah. But when, let's say when you're dreaming, when you're dying, but you're actually like, dying. like you're old, you're dying and you don't wake up. It's like, but you're dreaming that you're dying. And at that point, do you felt, do you know that you're just dead, dead? Like, how would you know you're going to wake up or not? Because you always know you're going to wake up when you dream. When you I guess you just hope you you get a satisfying conclusion to that dream. Because that that's, 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 that's the last thing you That's the last thing you're going to know. It could be an awful nightmare. Yeah. Right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, oh, God, this is the last thing I remember being chased down the hallway. By, like, but it is the most peaceful way to go. <laughs> <laughs> it is the most peaceful way to go. Yeah. Depending on what you're dreaming. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you're um, Tyrion Lannister. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait. What happened to Tyrion? What happened? He wanted to die with the... With mouth, mouth around his cock. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and a bottle of wine. And a bottle of wine. <laughs> well, gang, I think that's all of Rezero. We uh, love the... That was cool. Again, we're not continuing this show. Although I want to. That's a lot. That was, a lot of, that was, that was pretty maybe, great. Maybe? Sure. I, oh. Because, like, the other Norways would like this, too. I mean, uh, Mickey, like, just... If you play video games and shit, like yeah. they, they will love. He this. did come back stronger. I don't care. He did a little bit. He I mean, did. He, he tried to dodge at least. You know, he beat up those dudes in the alley. Yeah, yeah that was that was cool. He to do some tutorials. I have a, like a feeling that this like Pat did say that this might like just be a dream. Hmm. Maybe he's just like you know on his way from the store with his shit. But he's just like still in like the video game, like in his mind. Yeah, but wouldn't that be ultra unsatisfying though? Twelve hours. I don't know. I mean, if it's somebody's like. St- I mean, it wasn't lost all just a dream. If somebody's imagination no! is this rich. Hey, they're all, it's, it's 12 many, episodes and they're 24 minutes each. You, many, you didn't understand the ending or you're just fucking with me. How many, you're fucking with me, how many you? What did he say? He said, wasn't lost all just a dream. I'm like, uh, no. Don't uh, fuck it off for me. I'm on the last what, episode. What, that uh, is not what happened. Uh, how long is this? It's 12 uh, episodes, 24 minutes Is that it? Just no, one season? Wait, wait, season one, part one. Season one, part two. What? <laughs> exactly. So there's 12 episodes in part one and 12. 13 in part two. I don't think there's a season two, is there? I mean, part one, part two. Oh, one is original, one is not original. No, it's part two. It's, oh, yeah, okay. it's season one, part two. I, I think that's it. I think that's it. Is it, if that's if that's it, <laughs> I mean, can you go back? Oh, give me zero. Go back. Go back. One, 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 right there. Give me a zero. Give, give, give me now. I don't know. Three there's, more. there's a lot of anime with the word zero in it. All right. I mean, eventually we'll see what happens. Maybe if not, we'll watch on our own. I mean, it was just really good. If it's only, if it's only, if it's only, we'll see what happens down the road. I'm gonna drop a hundred dollars so that you can watch fucking Inuyasha episode. Yo, man, I'm gonna drop money for Food Wars. Here we go. (laughs) I'm gonna make y'all watch Food Wars. Oh, Oh, Russell Peters got a new stand-up special on Amazon Prime. Food Wars was rated as as, 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 as one of the animes that you cannot watch in public. Good. Did you see it? Did you see some clips that? So there's show you? like there's this one guy who has uh, a YouTube channel about reviewing animes you can't watch in public, or it's mm. just like one part of his channel. It's not a whole thing, but one of the things was Food Wars, and I had no oh, idea. Oh yeah, Chris, that. Chris, Mickey, and I looked up a clip the other day of uh. It's literally one like of, one of the food gasms. Yes. They have food gasms. Yeah, like they make food like they're they're competing for like who makes the best food that gives people orgasm. In this anime. Yeah. Food wars, yes. This whole time you guys have been talking about food wars, nobody so, ever told me that. Yeah, imagine, I thought it was actually co- cooking competition. Imagine that you eat it's a like sushi that's so show. perfect, but it, it gives you a fucking orgasm. Yeah, I bet yeah, the food no. looks so good on there, though. Man. No, I can't, I can't watch food. I want stuff. a sushi roll orgasm. I want to get ramen for lunch. You want to go? You guys orgasm? always want ramen for lunch. I'll me. go. I'll go with you. With a whey ramen, right? Yeah. Ram gasm. Ram gasm. Bye. Bye, everybody. Have fun, Ken. Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching our reaction request to ReZero. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Once again, a huge shout out to our super patrons, Smokem, Joe Mags, Luis, Ruby, Jesse, Allison, Tristan, Edward, Kelly, Keyboard Junkie, Sean, NYR fans, ZJP, and Diet Dan. Check out our Patreon tiers if you'd like to make a reaction request as well. Have a good one.